My name is Lucille Collard, and I've, uh, I'm the newly elected member for provincial parliament for Ottawa Vanier. So my name is Mathieu Fleury. I'm city councilor for the best part of our city, which includes Lower Town, Sandy Hill, and Vanier. I'm glad today to have the opportunity to share with you uh, a key area in my community. As you know, parks are very important. And one of our largest parks in my community is Strathcona Park, which has a long history um, for me personally, but obviously for the community. Uh, I love the space. I really love that it's a large space along the river, that there's so much, you know, ground to, to cover. Like, a, I, I like also what you can find in the park, which is, you know, you have um, the, the statue, uh, you know, which I think is impressive. And uh, also like the, um, the ruins, I think are pretty neat. My kids, uh, you know, used to go there to play. I think it's, it's really got like that cachet of historical, uh, kind of feeling to it. We need to recognize that we're still in the middle of this crisis. I mean, we're getting on the other side of it slowly, but what we want to make sure is that we don't go back to very severe conditions of confinement. So I think it's very important that people still respect uh, the space and respect each other. And, uh, you know, while it's a great place to meet, uh, there are still rules to abide by. And, uh, you know, we, we need to be respectful of each other. So just, you know, follow public health advice and everybody should be fine. I'll say it's an evolving situation. Yes, it's summer. Yes, enjoy our parks. But if, uh, if you're going with your family and just for a picnic, please be aware of uh, your surroundings. Please uh, make sure that uh, you're respecting distancing between folks. Uh, if you're out of your home, please wear a mask. I think for an area like Strathcona, Strathcona Park, most of the amenities are uh, okay. Uh, even the waiting pool will be opening uh, in, in early July. So the city uh, is slowly reopening, but we have to do so safely. Well, all members of the Odyssey Theatre, thank you for what you're doing here in our community. Thank you for what you're doing for arts in Ottawa. Uh, I want you to know that we love, we love it. We'll keep coming back to it. I will keep supporting you. So happy 35th and many more years to come. I know the 35th edition has a, a, a unique flavor to it that we're all living through. Uh, and I'm sure that uh, Odyssey will continue to thrive uh, in, our, in our great park in Strathcona. I really admire the work that Odyssey Theatre has done over the years. I think it encouraged uh, art to continue. I think it gives uh, the community an opportunity to have access to art without having to go and pay expensive fees and, you know, big, big rooms and in indoor spaces. So, like, I wish you many, many more years of performance in the park. I think that's an incredible, uh, interesting and, uh, you know, just a nice tradition to, to pursue. So I do hope you have many years and I look forward now that my kids actually are very comfortable in English that we can go see some play in the future. Odyssey, I wouldn't see it anywhere else but in Strathcona Park. I think it, it's, uh, it's a, 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 permanent, um, a permanent element that certainly is unique but certainly needs to continue and, and it's, it's, uh, you know, it, it, it's, a, it's a continued draw for locals. But I also see a lot of uh, residents who are a lot of tourists that come and visit our city that want to see those unique elements uh, that we have to offer as locals.